Welcome to the Hammond Power Solutions Millennium E Medium Voltage Dry Type Transformer Basic Training. The Millennium E is an energy efficient medium voltage VPI transformer. It complies with the US DOE 2016 and Canadian NARCAN 2019 efficiency regulations. A resin is applied in the vacuum pressure impregnation process which seals and protects the surface of the transformer and provides a strong mechanical bond for the windings. VPI windings are mechanically durable for the most demanding environments typically found in mining, crane, and other difficult mechanical applications. North America and international agency approvals and compliance includes UL and CSA approved and certified along with IEC 60076 compliance. Medium voltage transformers are primarily used for stepping down medium voltage to a lower operating voltage for commercial, institutional, or industrial applications. In some cases, medium voltage transformers may also be used to step up or increase the voltage. Medium voltage transformers are often found in industrial facilities including petrochemical, marine, oil and gas, mining, and wastewater. Medium voltage transformers are also found in commercial installations, data centers, and renewable energy projects where they are often used to step up the voltage. VPI dry type transformers can provide many benefits. They can be installed in locations near residents and schools or areas with environmental sensitivity because they don't utilize liquid for cooling. VPI transformers are safer and more cost effective to install inside a building. VPI transformers can be directly close coupled to switchgear. Triplex configurations allow for the units to be split into three separate pieces for installations with weight and dimensional constraints. VPI transformers are easy to test and visually inspect. VPI transformers provide many electrical and thermal advantages. VPI designs meet the efficiency standards mandated by the US DOE 2016 and Canadian NARCAN 2019 regulations. The coils are precision wound with copper or aluminum conductors that are electrically balanced to minimize axial forces during short circuit conditions. The VPI design has a robust interface between the core and coil for better short circuit performance and mechanical strength. The core is coated with a varnish to prevent the ingress of moisture. Fan cooling and low temperature rise versions create the broadest range of options for overloads and high ambient temperatures. The basic VPI construction provides many benefits. The doors are hinged and easily removed. The enclosures have a standard forklift capability for easy installation. No expensive rigging is required. Close coupled coordinated primary and secondary busing can be easily configured to match up with any switchgear configuration. No load taps are easy to access and change. Optional cooling fans provide additional capacity for overloads, high ambient temperatures, or to reduce the transformer size. VPI construction offers the simplest method to directly close couple between the transformer and switchgear. Vibration isolation pads and vibration isolation springs are used to minimize noise. Minimal maintenance is required beyond periodic inspection, checking connections, and removing surface contaminants such as dirt. Built-in enclosure forklift lifting points make installation quick and inexpensive. Enclosures can be disassembled and reassembled for flexible and easy installation in areas with space constraints. VPI construction provides a high degree of safety by being self-extinguishing in the unlikely event of a fire. VPI construction is environmentally friendly during normal use and decommissioning with low life cycle cost. While often designed for indoor applications, enclosure systems are available for outdoor locations or difficult environments including type 3R and 3R enhanced and non-ventilated versions including type 4, 4X, and type 12 enclosures. Typical product specifications include meeting US DOE 2016 efficiency regulations up to 2500 kVA and Canadian NARCAN 2019 regulations up to 7500 kVA. The Millennium E is available in higher kVAs up to 15 MVA. The Millennium E's 220 degrees C UL listed insulation system uses VPI construction. Units can be built up to 34.5 kV class and 175 kV BIL. 
Standard full capacity taps are provided at plus and minus 2.5% and plus and minus 5%. Typical secondary voltages include 600 volt class to 5 kV class. Environmental ratings include altitudes standard up to 1,000 meters with higher altitudes available as specified. Standard ambient temperature ranges from minus 20 degrees C to 40 degrees C with much higher temperatures available if needed. Units are built to meet the seismic compliance per IBC 2018 and AS ACE 7-16. California's OSHPOD certification is available as an option. In addition to the Millennium E, HPS offers three other medium voltage power transformer lines. The HPS Millennium G utilizes VPI construction and is only found in 5 kV class. Millennium G uses catalog standard designs up to 1500 kVA. Switchgear close coupling is not available. This series uses the most economical construction and has a standard type 3R enclosure for indoor and outdoor use. The Millennium G has limited options and accessories similar to 600 volt class transformers. The HPS Millennium C also uses VPI construction. It covers a wider voltage range from 5 kV up to 46 kV and is available in step up or step down configurations. The Type C is engineered to order while the Type E uses more standardized construction. Millennium C units has a wider range of KVA sizes up to 35 MVA. The Millennium C can also be close coupled to switchgear and has a wide range of optional accessories available for customization and protection. The HPS Enduracoil E uses CAS Rexon construction. It offers voltage classes from 5 kV up to 34.5 kV in step up or step down configurations. It is engineered to order and available up to 3 MVA. The Enduracoil can be close coupled to switchgear and provides a broad range of optional accessories available for customization and protection. Thank you for completing this presentation. We hope you have found it informative.